A possible hate crime this morning along West End Avenue in Nashville. Someone took aim at a synagogue, and that raises some real concerns for many people. Chris Cannon is live on West End tonight, and Chris, police still don't know who pulled the trigger, do they? Vicki, they're hoping security cameras or an eyewitness will give them the break they need in this case. Until then, security is on high alert at Jewish facilities across the mid-state. We've received no information. We've received no threats of that nature. Sometimes a possible hate crime comes with no warning. A maintenance man working at the West End Synagogue around 8.30 this morning heard a large bang. A short time later, he noticed something on the front of the building. And he saw this hole in the metal window frame, uh, knowing that, that was highly unusual. He had not seen it before, and as he looked at it even more closely, he saw that there was actually a bullet there uh, at the hole. This happened before most staff members arrived, so no one was hurt. Police hope security cameras will give them the lead they need. The police department has video experts who have arrived now and will be looking at the uh, security system to see if there's any potential evidence there. Police also focused on these tread marks, possibly left behind by the shooter. If you've been reading the newspapers and following the news, uh, incidents of anti-Semitism are up worldwide. Mark Friedman is with Nashville's Jewish Federation, and he says the shooting means stepped up security at Jewish facilities across the mid-state. Two vehicles blocked the driveway at the entrance to the Gordon Jewish Community Center Monday afternoon. Uh, our antenna is up, and uh, we'll be doing our utmost to continue to ensure the safety and security of our constituents. As the search continues for evidence, police hope someone saw something. West End Avenue would have been very busy, uh, as it is now, at 8.30 in the morning. The smallest of clues could help solve this possible hate crime. And right now, this 8.30 time frame is really all police have to go on. The shooting may have happened at a different time, and perhaps that security camera video will actually show us exactly when the shooting happened. Bottom line, if you were out here this morning and saw someone parked on West End Avenue here where there are some tread marks or someone walking by here that looks suspicious, Metro Police want to hear from you. You can call the Metro Crime Stoppers at 615-74-CRIME. We are live on West End. Chris Cannon, News Channel 5 HD.